what is a fundraiser, right? I got these things going on and I know that it's easy to lump all of these things we know into our past experience. So with that being said, how is this different? I'm gonna use these next couple videos, drop the links in there. So I am raising money to cover my living expenses in New York City and to travel abroad. Now, why is this? As someone who chose a different path, meaning I'm not really relying on big institutions, organizations to take care of what I do. I'm relying on my skills and my ability to build community and create services that help people to take care of me. So this asking for donations is one puzzle piece of a larger image. I'll take time to break that down. There are also ways for people to raise funds for themselves in this. So since 2007, that was a full, first full year that I started volunteering as a teaching artist. It took me two years of volunteering before I got paid. And then I started Creative Expressions in 2012 as a legal entity. Now, I did not start this as a business to make like a nonprofit or some big organization. I just started making enough bread doing teaching artist work where Uncle Sam came after me, I was getting hired all over the place, and then I formed a business, right? And everything that I get paid for, I started doing it as a service. Even when I get these gigs, because people who may not understand, like the arts organizations that I'm working with in Berlin and out here, they're helping me through giving me stipends and also like taking care of my airfare to go to Europe. But all of that added up doesn't even amount to one month's rent living in New York City. So what do we do about this? So when I stopped primarily focusing on doing teaching artist residencies myself, I helped train other teaching artists. So what did I do? I took money out of the paycheck that I was getting paid. I got to a level where I was getting paid because I was good at it and developed a skill. I was getting paid 100, 150 an hour. So I was able to take a percent of that and then train other artists to come into my gigs until they could get paid $75 starting. So this is how I operate. This is not how most people operate. And then what did I do? I built courses, training courses, grant writing courses, and I gave those away 100% free until I knew that they worked and other people were able to make thousands and thousands of dollars. Then I was like, okay, I can create the services. But guess what's the challenge? People can't even afford those services and high, high level investors, you have to create a network to reach people who have a certain financial practice. What do we do? So what I had to do was radical. I had to reshift my whole thinking and strategy and shout out to COVID for that because even though I was able to make grants, you're in competition with all these other big wigs. You're able to do things that are good for you, but how do they become sustainable for others? So I had to create things like the group chat to share the resources. I also had to create network and build sessions that were free. And then when I do events like this fundraiser I'm doing, I even though I'm raising the funds for me, I show people the hard skills. How do you make the connection to the venue? How do you build a set list? How do you create a backing band? How do you do all these things that you can do on your own to generate revenue for yourself? Because the old way of education it isn't by learning from a textbook. You have to learn by doing in real life. That's why if you look at the old ways of apprenticeship, that's where we created a lot of skilled folks. So how can others get involved with the information in my link in the bio and create something? Now look, if you looked at my EPK, you could create something like that for yourself. If you study what I'm actually doing, these are things that you could use as templates for your joint. If you refer creative expressions to a gig, you can get a referral fee. So these are all ways that you can make bread, but it takes a deeper understanding and a deeper building. Most people just see things and like, oh man, this person's doing this and that. We don't take opportunities to see that we are manifesting together and we are creating opportunities together. And the new way is gonna go beyond the capitalist model. It's gonna go beyond the 501c3 nonprofit industrial complex model. It's gonna go beyond begging people to listen to your music and selling streams and doing that. You know, we are still here where we dance with these things, but there's also something different that exists now.
I, I'm gonna cap it off here. And the reason I'm speaking to you guys direct is like, yes, there's there's a video link that's in the, the GoFundMe. It's all there, but like the most rawest, realest shit I could do is speak to you direct about my blessings, my skills, and my challenges. And this is what this is about now. You have to be able to be totally raw and honest. And yo, most people are gonna skip this shit. They're gonna ignore it. They're gonna do what they do. And that's fine because if one person sees the nugget and the jam, they can change their life. It's not me changing their life. It's them changing their life. Hit you with a little bit of freestyle, close it out. Hey, hey, I don't know what to do. I just keep changing like I am not what I was. I am what I am. Tomorrow's another day, but today's the only one that I am in. Still gotta make beats in a different way. Different night, different day. And it would've been the minute I break this down like it was ice capades. I'm skating. Flowing, open. Find your cause or lost flaws. Take this down. You could be your own boss. Ah, uh, ain't nobody telling you what to do. Gotta fill up your cup till it overflows into your crew. That's how we do. Nobody can do it alone. We get in the zone. You gotta find ways that are unknown. That's question mark. That's light to the dark. That's things over here that come with the spark. That's flames. You can't follow anybody else. That will make you go insane. But when you find that truth that separates you from everybody, you will know that it will be the divine moving through you. Don't follow these things that were already said and done. Cause they ain't gonna work no more. They're gonna lead to pain and suffering. Rather take the challenge of doing something that I never did. Facing that unknown. Getting all up in that zone. Could it ever do it? All alone, even you need to listen to this for this to even know that it exists. Maybe I just get it of a twist fire like I'm lighting tips of this split. I don't know it's all about this community, but I know it gotta start with you and me, and that's the unity and saying how it is, did it what it does. Yeah.